Hi there, Harvey Kelsey here, and I'm gonna teach you how to make the shockwave effect in sunny Vegas. You probably see seen the effect on movies like Transformers, and the reason why I did the effect was I saw the tutorial from the LMP 23 for After Effects, and I th thought, can I make this on sunny Vegas? And I could do it. Uh, it's not perfect, you know, but has some defects. But it's cool. So let's get started. Get your footage. Gonna call this. You jumping from something like me. Here's the footage. I start another video track and call it Ring, for example. Now, I have Camtasia. Okay. Now you go to Media Generators, Media Generators, Color Gradient, and Elliptical Ring. Drag it. See where you fall right here, and begin right there. So. In the first frame of the ring, you make it small, really small. Try to make it smaller. Right. And in the last frame, you make it big. You probably. This is the effect. So now make it a 3D source alpha and go to track motion right here. <coughs> now you want to rotate that like the, this way so you can, so that looks like you are. Is in the floor actually. So now you got this. This is the basic idea. So it's cool. Um, this will not look perfect because you know you see the shock wave hitting my feet. I will not try to avoid that. That requires masking, and I'm not with patience to do that. So, but here is the warming. So you have this, right? No, what what you're gonna do is delete the video, the footage, and render the ring. Render ring. so it's faster now that you render the video we'll go to Sony Vegas again import your video right? your footage and import the video just render the ring <coughs> So get your footage, and now what you gotta do is add the ring to your footage. So let's go frame by frame here. Shit, right here, and. Oh yeah, for that I forgot or something. So th it's already timed because you timed it in the last time. Now you see the black background, 
you want to remove it <coughs> go to video effects chroma key and choose any one of these oh you have black screen actually let's just remove some low trash hole You need it to render because now you're gonna make it custom. Mm. So choose Sony Hate Map. Now you just have to mess with this. Let me see. Let's make this about, I don't know, 100 elevation. kind of smaller let's just adjust it let's make it a little bigger so you should have this Make it a little bigger. Just it a bit. Let me see now. Oh yeah. So I'm gonna do another thing. Let's m make it smaller so goes like back to give the idea <coughs> that it goes back right where my feet hit it and of course you have to track motion this um, not just this you got this here Basically, it's this. I have, I have a video uploaded on YouTube showing the effect. I didn't work hard on it. I made it in about five, ten minutes. It's really fast, no masking, so it doesn't look perfect. It's probably one of the worst videos I've uploaded. But y you, you have the idea. You sh you see the shockwave right there. You can make it better if you have some experience, but I could make a more detailed tutorial, but I have no pages for that. <coughs> yeah. <coughs> so be sure to check out my channel. I have a video semi advanced jumper effect created on After Effects in Sony Vegas. Some special effects, Sony Vegas tutorials, Photoshop tutorials, uh, fun stuff. You want? You probably gonna like it. Check out my blog too. It's Portuguese, but you can use a translator to make it in English, like Babelfish. Uh, recently, I made the reveal of Splinter Cell Double Agent, uh, Gears of War 2. 96% out of ten, out of 100. Assassin's Creed, blah blah blah. Singularity. Yeah. So be sure to check out my channel and my blog. And I hope you like it. Here we go. See you.